A police chase over the weekend ends with the death of an innocent man in Newark. And CBS 2's Alice Gaynor reports now a state agency is looking into what happened. New cell phone video given to CBS 2 by neighbors shows the end result of a police pursuit that began a town over in Hillside and ended on Braga Avenue and Aldine Street in Newark. 18 wheeler crashing together. Two 18 wheelers. Very loud. Yes. This Nothing man, who did not want to show his face on camera, heard it happen outside his window. Many neighbors say the loud crash woke them up. Officials say a Hillside police officer was in pursuit of a Nissan Altima with three men inside. But just after 2.30 Saturday morning, that Altima struck a Ford Mustang, pushing it into a utility pole. The victim, Omar Martin, a correctional police officer at Newark's Northern State Prison, became trapped in his car and died. Today, a growing memorial to the man described by loved ones as outgoing and generous. Generous, a father to a son. This is a little rough right now, but he's just, he loved life. And it's hard, it's hard to see anybody taken away, but especially a person that loved life the way that he loved it. At least a half a dozen neighbors tell us the end of the chase took place going the opposite direction on the one way street of Aldine. The guys are coming from Hillside this way, down this one way, doing like 90. Going the wrong way and the one way chasing? Yes. The New Jersey Attorney General's Shooting Response Task Force is now investigating since law enforcement was involved. It would not comment on any more specifics of the case. Hillside Police referred us to the AG's office, as did the Essex County Prosecutor's Office. According to police pursuit policy in New Jersey, officers are allowed to pursue into a different jurisdiction as long as they notify authorities there. They are supposed to terminate a pursuit if there is a clear and unreasonable danger to the police officer or the public. Two of the suspects were taken to the hospital and another to the Hillside Police Station. As for their identities and charges, those have not yet been released. In Newark, New Jersey, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News. The Correctional Officers Union tweeted the suspects were in a stolen car. Now the Attorney's General Office is investigating due to a new law enacted just this past year. It requires the Attorney General to get involved when a death occurs during an encounter with a law enforcement officer.